What's up? In this tutorial, I'm going to show you on how to use the tooltip in JavaFX. So creating the tooltip in JavaFX is very easy and it's very easy to implement to your application. So the tooltip is used for showing additional information to the user if they are confused of something or they want additional information about this node or this button. So the tooltip is perfect to use. Alright, so in this video you will know how to create a tooltip, uh, add some icon or a graphic, and a CSS. Alright, so let's get started. Now I'm going to use the IntelliJ IDEA as the IDE. And the first thing we're going to, I'm going to show you is to create a tooltip using the scene builder and the second one is to code it manually in our IDE. Alright, I'm gonna open my uh, what's this one? Seal scene Builder and I'm gonna add a layout something like stack pane and drag it here right so the next one is button I'm gonna drag some button here to our stack pane stack pane layout and the last thing is the tooltip tooltip right now I'm gonna put it to our button and the currently we are currently selected to the tooltip and this one text is the tooltip text now I'm gonna change this to this is uh, this is a button button all right and we can also auto fix or to hide the tooltip consume auto hide I don't know what's what is that what is that used for and content display left top right bottom center all right now I'm gonna save this and let's open the IDE and it's I think it's ready to go and let's run our program to see what that looks like all right now if I'm going to hover over the button the tooltip will show last one this is a button all right we can also add some graphic to our tooltip by adding this uh, by setting the set graphic and the graphic all right so the next one is to code it manually now I'm going to close this and comment these codes right here. Alright, and let's create another line. Now I'm going to use this tag pane layout. Alright, and let's... Uh, Alright, I think that's it. And let's create the scene or a button first button btn equals button and let's import the class and I'm gonna add an initial text here so this one is save something like that and I'm gonna create the scene scene new scene and pass in the layout here I'm gonna uh, put the button inside our layout so let's call the layout get, get children get add and btn alright and now I'm gonna call the stage so stage that set scene and pass in the scene object here and that's it and stage that set title oops title this will be understanding understanding the tooltip and show the stage stage that show okay now I'm gonna create a tooltip I'm gonna make another line here so tooltip 
excuse me, tooltip, I'm going to create an object, equals new tooltip, and tooltip that set text, save the, for example, save the image, save the image, all right, and I'm going to show the tooltip. And to show this one, btn that set tooltip and tooltip. All right, and I'm gonna first I'm gonna specify the scene size. Let's say 200 by 200, and that's it. And let's run the program. All right, and I'm gonna hover over the see save button. It will show the tooltip. Save the image, all right? So the next one is to add a graphic. Now to add a graphic is very easy. So I'm gonna open the icons eight or this one. So for example, save image like this one. Excuse me, all right, like this one. I'm going to set this to 15, like this, all right, and I'm going to drag it over here, and icon. All right, so this is inside the... I'm gonna drag it here or I'm gonna create another folder directory IMG something like that and all right so <coughs> excuse me and I'm gonna add an image image class I'm gonna use the image class and image equals new image get class that get resource as stream and img icon png you see that all right and i'm gonna make another node here as uh <coughs> image view because i'm gonna use the image view as our container for our image IV image right goes new image view and pass in the image object all right now I'm going to use the tooltip tooltip that set graphic and IV. So let's try to run our application to see what that looks like. If it is working, all right. And hover the button. The icon is here, right beside the label or text. See that? It's kind of small, right? So to add a uh, CSS to our tooltip, it's very easy. We can use the set style or inline inline CSS code, or we can create a CSS file right here. Uh, where is it? Uh, this one. I almost didn't see it. All right, we can use this one or add uh, an, an inline CSS code. So I'm gonna use tooltip that set style. For example, um, fx background color is white. I'm gonna use a white background color. And fx, oops, 
text fill black. What's wrong? Remove, okay, I don't know. Forgot to add it. Another parameter here. FX text field black. And let's try to run our application to see what that looks like. And I'm gonna hover over the button. Yes, you see that? It's a white black background and a black text. All right, that's it. That's how you use the tooltip in JavaFX. I hope you learned something new in this tutorial. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. And I will see you in the next video.